Did it surprise you at all, Vuk, to hear the president issue this kind of criticism when in the past, at least while he's been running for office, he's been portrayed as pro-Russian and even close to Vladimir Putin? I wasn't surprised uh, with those words because I have been saying uh, for years uh, Serbia is uh, engaged in its uh, balancing act where its leadership likes to play off uh, Russia and the West uh, against each other. But uh, Belgrade is uh, not uh, Moscow's uh, proxy. It has its uh, own uh, it has its own agency. And so to speak, uh, the story about uh, potential uh, Serbian recruiters for uh, mercenary positions in the uh, Ukraine conflict theater, particularly if it involved the uh, Wagner group, uh, that was uh, too much heat to bring down even for uh, Serbian leadership. So mm. uh, the angry reaction was uh, expected. And I think that it is uh, also a sign and a message from Belgrade that while Belgrade hasn't closed all of its uh, doors to Moscow, there is a limit on uh, how far uh, Belgrade will go with its partnership with Moscow. You know what, though, Vuk, early on in the war, there were pictures and news stories coming out of Belgrade of people holding, waving Russian flags and supporting the war. How widespread do you think that sentiment actually is among the public? And is it enough that people are willing to go fight for it? Well, mercenaries have been an integral part of the Balkan uh, l uh, security landscape ever since uh, the Yugoslav wars. And you will always find individuals from uh, former Yugoslavia fighting in uh, various uh, conflict uh, theaters worldwide. So on that point, uh, I wasn't, uh, I wasn't uh, shocked. And the reason why Russia is popular, it has nothing to do with the Slavic and Orthodox ties, but with the simple fact that for the majority of the population, the, so, uh, Russia is perceived as uh, something of a savior, as a counterweight to the West. So mm. frequently, Russia is popular not for what it is, but what for, for what it is not. It is not the West. Russia is seen as a way to vent out frustrations with the bitter memories of the 1990s and to vent out frustration against the West because uh, it uh, backed uh, Kosovo's declaration of independence. However, while the public opinion polls might show uh, strong uh, sympathies, perhaps, towards uh, the Russian perspective, it is also true that in those same uh, public opinion polls, uh, the majority of the population believes that the country uh, should uh, remain uh, neutral and mm. uh, maintain its balanced position in this conflict. So while there may be a lot of... Uh, Z uh, T-shirt, perhaps that can be uh, bought in Belgrade. Uh, there is uh, uh, there is a limit to how far both the society and the foreign policy elites are willing to go. All right, Vuk Busanovic, I like the way you tell it like it is. Thanks so much. Thank you.